Smurfy greetings YouTubers, it is I3 Hellgear along with Munchie. Welcome back to Smurf's Epic Run. Question of the video, yeah I'm doing it early. Yes, we're doing it early. What was your highlight of this summer? Was your highlight of the summer kicking it with me for the runs? Hmm? Yeah, it was. Let me know in the comments section and let Munchie know in the comments section below your highlights for this summer. Because as you know, summer is over. I get to play. Yeah, summer's over. I get to I cry. I Anyways, gang, while summer has come to an end, I'm still planning on taking the time out to run with you guys here in Smurf's Epic Run. That's not going to stop. So, as always, thank you for coming out to run. Thank you for watching. Thank you for every like, comment, favorite, share, and subscribe. And if you are enjoying this run, by all means, and I do mean this, by all means, subscribe. That way I can entertain you guys a lot better than I do now. Alright, so, first and foremost, this is going to be another bank-breaking episode. To those of you who don't know this, the bank-breaking episodes are as follows. No new stages are run during a bank-breaking episode. It's just previously done stages simply to stack coin. If something like this isn't to your liking, give the video a like and skip ahead to the next episode. If the next episode is not available at the time that you're watching this, feel free to check out some of the other videos on the channel. Thanks for coming by. Alright. So, to all of you who are sticking around, this bank breaking episode is going to be unique. As you can see, got Pirate Smurf here with us today. After, pre after yesterday's episode ended, I took the liberty of actually just grabbing it. All right. So, where shall this one begin? All right, we'll start here. Now, to those of you who are still here and curious, bank breaking stages, like I said, it's not going to be anything new. It's just previously run stages. If a stage attempt is failed, that's fine. There will be no retries, it's just on to the next stage. But yeah, Pirate Smurf today. Ready to run? Yeah. Alright. Feels good to have Pirate Smurf today. And of course, Snow Leaf is going to help out with the loot stacking because Pirate Smurf has that wonderful ability that when double coins are active, it's actually triple coins. So if you're going to stack money with Pirate Smurf, you want to take either Snow Leaf or um, Cherry. You know, Cherry because she has the magnet. Oh, that was well timed. Beautiful. Now, just so everybody knows, when the double, when Pirate Smurf has his triple coin function active and you pick up those blue coins that you have to get the eight of to get the big 50 piece, you still get the three coin, the three per coin. I figure why the hell not, right? 
Spun 125 racks just to get him, why not use him? And I said, business is about to pick up. What's with the unconsiderable amounts of lag? And I'm so mad I didn't get that loot. Oh well. There we go. Very nice. 636 on the coin count is actually very useful. Yeah, we got a lot of money that time. Yeah, we got a lot of money. All right. But yes, that is the real issue when it comes to these bank breaking episodes. You know, the whole point of it is simply to stack that money. Because, uh, as you guys already know, Smurfs cost. Now, I shouldn't have to tell you, Smurfs cost. You know, 100 racks for Thief Smurf. 80 for Jokey. 70 for Flying Smurf. 90 for Smurfette. You know, the permanent double coin offer is still on the table and like I said still considering it oh man the camera got knocked out come on there we go you know in the beginning, I used to read all this stuff that Brandy Smurf said, but I think I've read all of these things. At least until like, I installed the Odyssey update. You know. Installing the Odyssey update is fine and dandy, but I'm not that far. Yeah, that was worth it. I still had invincibility. Boom, boom. Well, that would have been nice to have, but eh. I ain't hurting on it. Yeah. This is good. That's good. That's real good. That's right. All that beautiful loot. All of that beautiful loot. Well, that's a good 400 bucks that won't be taken to the bank. <laughs> I guess it's only fair that the bank fights back. Yeah, it's only fair that the bank fights back. Yeah, we're waiting for the next for the next day. Alright. Ferngrass still needs seven minutes before I can send him out to get another key, so let him cool down. Let's look around. Yeah. Haven't opened up another gold chest because all these gold chests have been opened already. Wait a minute, I saw that one. There we go. You know, opening up all the gold chests is one thing, but to open up the chests Constantly, and uh, you know what? Screw it. 
We'll take that one. More money. Money is good. But not all money is good money. Just remember that, folks. Not all money is good money. Well, I disagree with you, Three Hell Gear. All money is good money. Trust me. Not all money is good money. Not just in video games, but also in real life. Not all money is good money. Speaking of which... I'll send you to go grab energy. There we go. You know what? I'm gonna open this chest. Just because. Ten gems, thousand dollars. Nice. Next stage for the bank. See? That actually helped out with the bank too. Got a thousand bucks. I guess that makes up for the near 400 that was lost. Time to run again. Yeah, that's right. Shake it off. Into the next stage we go. You know, And like I said before, folks, even though he's 125 rats, Pirate Swerf is... Oh, too bad. Couldn't get the triple values there. And only got two of the three coins. Oh, well. You know, for 125 racks, Pirate Smurf is worth his weight in uh, gold. Too bad I can't take the double coin potion into this. Would have been nice. Man, is there like a delay going on here? Alright. Good, 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 good. Yes, catch up to me, please. Crap. <laughs> oh, well. Sorry, Snow Leaf. That would have been sweet to have the triple there. All right. That's good. This is actually really good. You know. Alright. That was pretty decent. Five hundred home is a good amount of money. That's actually a really good amount of money. Not bad, not bad good good chip stacking today yeah we stack a lot of money you got a wet forehead you been sweating come here no that's not that's not wet forehead that was dry forehead it just looked like wet forehead Thank you, Snow Leaf. Nope. Still not up yet. So let's let Ice Nest grab some lightning. I'll probably make a note to go to Cloud's Plains next. Because there's still stuff to do there. 
So, I guess grabbing all this energy is a good thing. Mm -hmm. Ready for the next stage? Ready. Yep. That smile and clap says everything. Let's do some more running. Now, some of you may probably be watching this and you're like, well, Three Hell Gear, if you're going through all of these multiple stages like this, just to break the bank, how come you only do four stages in a normal run? Well, <laughs> okay, there goes the, the, the delay going out. You know, I figure not to overflow everything that I normally would. And I don't always do four stages a day. That's just what I have set for the norm. If I'm behind one or if things are going really good, maybe I'll get in a fifth stage. But, as some of you guys have seen, when going through a lot of stages, the tablet will either overheat and uh, stuff gets erased. Yeah, give me all that loot. Yeah. And the last thing I want is, you know, yeah, all of that loot. Nice triple coin value at the end there. Five thirty-seven is a good amount of loot. Also, when I do these bank breaking stages, flying smurf stages, you know, the green ones on the map, those are skip. Because, you know, you don't get Pussy Willow Pixie help there. You know, I like to keep, what's the word? What's the word I'm looking for? Oh, right, right, right. That's the word I'm looking for. It's called moderation. You know. You can only do so much. Because moderation is healthy. You know, you can't have too much of a good thing. And in most cases, you can't have too much of a bad thing either. You know? It's like if you're on a diet. You can only take in so many calories a day. But if you take in twice as many calories than you should, it's not really going to help you out. You know, you want to be able to have the proper balance of everything. You know, this is like when you're on a diet and you have that's called that quote unquote cheat day, right? Well, think of the bank breaking episodes as the quote unquote cheat day for the daily runs of Smurf Epic Run. This is the cheat day and what better way to go through the cheat day than to stack your chips, you know? Collecting that loot is one of those things that's very important because you know that old saying, you gotta pay the cost to be the boss, right? right. See, even Munchie knows this. Even if she is very, very young. Ah. <laughs> uh. But yeah, sat yesterday's episode, the Saturday, that was that was a surprise. I'm not even gonna lie, that was a surprise. You know, I really did not have Smurfs Epic Run epi recording eps. You know, it wasn't planned for that Saturday. But I did it anyway because of you guys showing the love. Come on. There we go, right on top. You gotta take advantage of that setup whenever you can. Well, 
second too late, but that's fine. This is actually pretty decent. Getting a nice amount of coin until the fall. Ah, uh, that was almost 600 coin there. Gone. <laughs> almost 600 coin there. Gone. Oh well. And the good thing about this episode also is I get to showcase pirate smurf. So everybody who decided to skip forward, well that's okay. You can skip forward, I don't blame you. Nothing new is happening here. Like He's just that. stacking that loot. Bobby. Yep, just stacking loot. What? It'll be interesting to see what you guys have in store for when you want to make like money runs and whatnot. Because everybody's got to have that loot, that loot stack. Wow! Wow! You know? Mikey. So what was the greatest highlight for my summer? Uh. I'll be honest with you, this summer hasn't been all that great. You know, having multiple family deaths this summer was not, that wasn't fun. What the hell just happened? You were supposed to bounce off the spring, boo. See, people talk about RNG. Well, sometimes, RNG decides to be a decides just to be an ass, an all-out ass, and it's like, yeah, we know we are supposed to use this momentum to bounce off the springs, but you know, just this once, we're gonna have you fall right into the pit. I should be using Poet Smart for this because of the gliding challenges, but that's fine and dandy too. All right, come on camera, focus. There we go. The funny thing is I see people do have their little videos and records and sometimes while they're playing the camera just goes out of whack. It's not just me, it's everybody. Everybody has that issue where they want their camera to focus and they'll go for the focus and whatnot. All right, I can't get those stacks, that's fine. I'll get all that. Well, not all of that was triple coin value. You know, that, that reminds me of another saying. Don't take everything you see at face value. But it's nice that the double coins with Pirate Smurf is, is triple coins, because triple coin, Oh, come on, I jumped, boo. It would have been nice to actually get all that. Oh, mmm, too late. I gotta stop dying near the end of the stages too because that, that just irritates everything. That disrupts the balance of good gameplay. Yes, it disrupts the balance. Are you scolding me because I fell at the end of the stage? See? Even Munchie talks me out of things when I get to the end of the stage and die. She's like, no, you shouldn't be doing that. Alright. Hey. 
Let's get in one more and then call it a run. Again, want to thank you guys for coming out here to run. Thank you coming. Thanks for coming out to watch. Thanks for the bank breaking. Pirate Smurf knows how to get a lot of loot. Oh yeah, bam, that was beautiful. That's right. All that loot, all that loot. Good. Too bad the booze didn't last long enough for that. It's fine. All right, it wasn't a death, so I'm not gonna complain about it. Bounce off of that. Alright, good, good, good. Nice, nice, nice. And I'm mad I didn't get that one. No dying at the end of this stage. That's a lot of loot to take home. Thank you, Pirate Smurf. Again, thank you, Pirate Smurf. That was glorious. Truly glorious. All right. That's going to do for today's bank breaking episode. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. I know I enjoyed it, even in light of the fact that there were some deaths near the end of the stages. And you know what? Search the map and then I'll wrap up this episode with a spin. So yes, I'll be Interested to hearing, interested in reading what your summer experiences were because I know a lot of people they're they're like, ah, got to get back to class, got to go back to school, boring, no, you know, one of the people that isn't like that is my niece. She she graduated from high school this summer. So I guess that was one of the more positive things that happened for me during the summer because oh that that was a that was a that was a proud moment for me. First spin today. Collection piece. Haven't had one of those in a while. All right. I know this takes away a thousand and something on the loot, but hey, got some of it back. All right. Yeah. Raise your thumbs if you enjoyed this one. Now let me take my goose from the oven because I'm done. See you tomorrow.